My name is Jeff Kloon, and I am a professor here at the University of Wyoming. The focus of our lab is to evolve artificially intelligent robots. And the research we focus on is why intelligence evolved in nature. How nature produced the, all the amazing things that you see out there in the natural world, such as jaguars, hawks, and even the human brain. The reason that's interesting is because we want to try to create intelligent robots. After a nuclear disaster or an earthquake, as opposed to sending humans into harm's way, it would be better if we could send robots out into the world to find survivors or pick up radioactive waste. Supercomputing underlies everything that we do here. We constantly are doing experiments where we create inside of a computer an evolutionary process. We try to study uh, just like in nature, how evolution evolved, how that can happen inside of a computer in a virtual world. We constantly need to set up simulations of lots of agents interacting with each other, killing each other, eating each other, having sex with each other. And basically it's a survival of the fittest process where the smarter survive. We need to do lots of experiments on lots of different virtual worlds and different settings to try to figure out under what conditions does intelligence evolve. So one thing that's cool about this work is you can use the same technology to evolve 3D objects, which you can see here, but also you can evolve the brains of artificially intelligent robots.